Hello everyone. Today I'm going to cover 10 best psychology courses on Coursera. There are various reasons why taking an online psychology course can be a good choice. Whether you are new to the subject of psychology or are a practicing psychologist, the opportunity to dive into an introductory course that is both entertaining and informative is a fantastic way to begin your study in psychology. For individuals with prior experience, it can be an opportunity to learn about new trends and broaden their knowledge. In this article, we have compiled a list of top 10 Coursera psychology courses that will help you learn more about the human brain and psychology. Number 1. Introduction to Psychology, Yale University What are the things that people are most afraid of? What is the significance of our dreams? What brings us joy? What leads to mental illness and how can it be prevented? This course attempts to answer these and the other concerns by providing a broad review of scientific research on the human brain and behavior. Perception, communication, learning, memory, decision making, emotions and social behavior are among the themes covered. We will examine how these characteristics of the mind grow in childhood, how they differ between people, how they are wired up in the brain and how they break down as a result of illness or injury. At number 2nd, we have Social Psychology, Wesleyan University. This course covers topics such as decision making, persuasion, group behavior, personal attraction and factors that promote health and well-being through a quick introduction to classic and contemporary social psychology. Our focus will be on scientific findings that are surprising, entertaining and engaging that may be applied in everyday life. Exclusive content from the Social Psychology Network, the world's biggest online community devoted to social psychology will also be used in the course. At number 3, we have Abnormal Psychology, Wesleyan University. This course gives students an overview of abnormal psychology. You will learn many of the basic ideas of how diagnosis and treatment have been used throughout the history of psychology as well as how to empathically respond to people in distress. You will also learn some basic skills to make desired changes in your own life. Skills that you will learn in this course are motivation, knowledge about psychology, behavior, skill of setting objectives. At number 4, we have Positive Psychiatry and Mental Health, the University of Sydney. Mental illness and distress are common in today's environment and they account for a large burden of disability in our community. We will look at several elements of mental health as well as provide an overview of the primary types of mental diseases, their causes, treatments and how to get help and support in this course. We will hear from lived experiences experts who have lived with mental illness and shared their personal experiences of recovery as well as a huge number of professionals in psychiatry, psychology and mental health research. At number 5, we have Introduction to Psychology University of Toronto. This course will focus on the most intriguing psychological experiments as well as the consequences of such research for our knowledge of human mind and behavior. You will look at human growth and talk about how other people's actions influence our thoughts and actions. Finally, several types of mental diseases will be described as well as remedies for people who suffer from them. Skills that you will learn in this course are emotional problems, psychology, psychology of social interaction, mental health issues. At number 6, we have Psychological First Aid, Johns Hopkins University. You will learn how to give psychological first aid to people in an emergency using the RAPID approach, which stands for Reflective Listening Assessment of Needs, Prioritization, Intervention and Disposition. This specialized training course uses the RAPID model to present insights on injuries and trauma that go beyond physical. Skills that you will learn in this course are listening with intention, active listening techniques, crisis management, first aid for psychological trauma. At number 7, we have the science of well-being, Yale University. In this course, you will complete a series of challenges intended to boost your happiness and develop more productive habits. It reveals common myths about happiness, frustrations in the minds that cause us to think the way we do, and research that can help us modify our ways of thinking. After completion of this course, you will eventually adopt certain wellness exercises into your daily routine. Skills that you will learn in this course are gratitude, happiness and meditation. At number 8, we have Understanding the Brain, the Neurobiology of Everyday Life, the University of Chicago. 
This course will teach you how the neurological system influences behavior, how we use our brain daily, and how neuroscience may explain today's typical problems. We will learn about functional human neuroanatomy and neural transmission and then apply what we have learned to better comprehend how we perceive the environment, move our bodies voluntarily, stay alive, and collaborate with others. Skills that you will learn in this course are basics about human brain, nervous system disorders, neurobiology, and neurology. At number 9, we have the arts and the science of relationships understanding human needs, University of Toronto. This course introduces participants to the fundamental ideas of strategies and skills learning and development system, SSLG, as well as their application in everyday relationships. It explains the fundamental principles and methodologies of SSLG with case studies in relationship management to demonstrate the points. Skills that you will learn in this course are assertiveness, communication, and relationship building. At number 10, we have Know Thyself, the value and the limits of self-knowledge, the unconscious, the University of Edinburgh. The unconscious is a difficult yet interesting topic on the path to self-knowledge. This course will investigate some of the most significant ideas regarding the unconscious, beginning with Sigmund Freud's work and progressing through the evolution of unconscious theories to current experimental psychology research. But be warned, some of what you learn about your unconscious mind may be surprising. So, that was our research on the best psychology courses available on Coursera. We hope you were able to understand more clearly about them and opt the one which suits you the best. Wish you happy learning.